Hello and uh, welcome to our Google Calendar tutorial. This is going to be on a extension called Events Merge. And so um, let's go ahead and take a look at my calendar. Now one thing as you notice is my calendar is shared um, with some other people and these people happen to have some of the same events that I do on my calendar. For example, this Tosa chat, the Dig Sit video, you can see those events up, up here twice. The Salsa Showdown's on here twice. Um, and this other event is on here twice. And so um, this kind of happens when you work with colleagues that you go to similar meetings with um, sometimes. And um, it, it takes up a lot of space in your calendar. So one way you can do this is in an extension called Events Merge. And extensions um, are specifically for Chrome, Chrome extensions, and they add functionality to your Chrome. So I'm gonna click here and I'm gonna go to Events, Merge. It doesn't even matter if I spell everything right, Chrome extension. Um, and so I can see right here, uh, event merge uh, for Google Calendar right here, Google Chrome. So I'm going to go ahead and click on that and it's going to open up and you're going to see that this is an extension. I can see that right here. And you can see event merge for uh, Google Calendar. And so the information it shows me is, look, it's going to take these three different events um, and make them into one event. Uh, so you can see, let's see how that works. Um, when I add this to Chrome, it's going to pop up in the top right hand corner right up by my little guy. Um, it's going to ask me um, if I want to add this extension. Yes, I want to add it. Uh, it's going to pop up right about here. Let's see. Boom. There it is. And so um, this has been added to Chrome. And so I'm going to click X. Now let's go back to my calendar and see how this might work. Let me click it and I'm going to uh, unclick it again and uh, let's kind of refresh my, my calendar page here. And so uh, what you notice is when I refresh now, if before you saw awesome training was uh, two different uh, events, now I see it as one. These other events that you can see um, that are overlapping events, I can see it as one. I can see the colors of the calendar is as how the stripes are determined. Um, also, like this event is, is white, that means that person hasn't uh, accepted it yet. So if I wanna undo that, I just come up here and click on it. And then you can see the events are separate. And if I click on it again, now I can see the events are overlapping or together. So there's the week view. Um, let's go ahead and take a look at uh, the day view. Again, uh, side by side calendars, no overlapping events here, but an overlapping event here. I can see three calendars at once, which is pretty awesome. If I don't wanna see those calendars, I can just unclick them down here, by the way. Um, but I think that's pretty cool. It takes my top two calendars and the other two calendar. Uh, but again, events merge, it lets it merge. Again, there's an on. If I turn it off, then you're gonna see uh, two events right here, like the awesome training. I turn it on again, and then you can see they're merged together. So this just kind of helps make your calendar a little bit cleaner if you share multiple events um, with people that uh, or calendars that you don't want to show up multiple times. Um, thanks for watching, and rewatch if you need a little bit more help.